Welcome to Russell Yog's YouTube channel. Today we'll discuss the three salutes to Mother Earth. We'll go over precision, technical precision for each one. There are four levels of mastering the asana. Technical or precision, dance, ritual, and worship. Today we'll discuss first, second, and third salutes to Mother Earth. First salute to Mother Earth strengthens the back, the triceps, and shapes the glutes. Ek Dharat Namaskar, first salute to Mother Earth. Begin by standing on the toes, arms distance away from the ropes, feet about shoulder width apart. Slowly lower down into a squat. Take the ropes low in one hand. Bring the other forearm to the floor. Knees on the ground, then slide the legs back so you're on your stomach. Extend the ropes forward, holding the ropes at the level of the throat. Lift the toes and curl them under. Press the toes into the mat, lifting the knees. Sweep the free arm back. Rest it either on the mat or on your lower back. Open the chest. As you pull down strongly on the ropes, press the toes into the floor and raise the opposite leg, flexing the foot. Pressing the heel back. Keep the tension on the rope. Engage the buttock muscles. Point the toes down. Take three breaths, holding the posture. Release. Relax the feet. Sweep the arms forward, creating a pillow with your forearms and resting your head. Then repeat on the other side. Common errors of first salute. Stand away from the ropes at arm's distance. Holding the ropes too high can strain the shoulders. Bring the hand down to the level of your throat. As you extend your arm forward, keep the elbow slightly bent and the chest broad. As you sweep your arm back and place the hand on the back, avoid dropping the shoulder. Open the chest. As you pull down on the ropes, keep the raised leg straight, not bent. Press the opposite toes into the floor, tensing the body. When you raise the leg, keep it straight rather than bending the knee. Press the heel back and point the toes towards the floor. Lengthen. Do Dharat Namaskar, second salute to Mother Earth. Kneel tall under the anchor, knees about shoulder width apart. Curl the toes under for balance. Lift the chest. Draw the shoulders back and down. Taking the ropes low, one in each hand, bow forward. Pressing the chest towards the earth, keeping the hips over the knees. Lengthen out the spine as you extend the arms forward. Shift one knee and the toes towards the center. Balance on that leg, then slide the other leg back, flexing the foot. As you steady yourself, raise the straightened leg, flexing the foot, pressing the heel back, toes pointing down. Square the shoulders and breathe. Keep the gaze steady, looking a few feet ahead. Keep the throat open. The elbows slightly bent to protect the shoulders. Then release. Bring the knee down. Sit back and use the ropes to sway or stretch. Common errors of second salute to Mother Earth. One error is to hold the ropes too high. You want the arms to be straight as you bow forward. The other error is to bring the hips forward as you bow. You want to keep the hips back over the knees. Curl the toes under for balance rather than keeping the feet flat. This helps with your balance. As you raise the leg, keep it straight 
rather than bending the knee. Extend. Keep the shoulders equal distance to the floor rather than askew. Bend the elbows slightly if you feel any undue strain in the shoulders. Open the throat by looking ahead a few feet. Release, relax, and enjoy this posture of exploration and balance. Third salute to Mother Earth. Stand tall right under the anchor. Hold each rope in each hand and bow forward to Mother Earth, pressing the chest down and moving the hand slightly down the rope to accommodate your stretch. Shift one foot to center. Balance on that leg. Flex the other foot and raise the leg behind you keeping your shoulders square, lifting the leg, pointing the toes down, and extend, reaching the leg back, hips over the heel, reach, square the shoulders, feel light as you lengthen, hold for three breaths, then release, bringing the foot back, separate the feet a bit, and as you hold on to the ropes, gently sway from side to side or stretch up and reach. Common errors of third salute. Holding the ropes too high. Lower the hands down the ropes. As you bow forward, keep the hips over the heels rather than reaching too far forward. An error is to hold the ropes too low. You want to bring the ropes up so the torso is relatively parallel to the floor. Another common error is to make the shoulders uneven. Square them so they're equal distance to the floor. Reaching the arms forward, keep a slight bend in the elbows to avoid straining the shoulders. The standing leg stays straight. The raised foot is flexed and the toes are pointed down. The raised leg reaches back as you rely less and less on the ropes, bringing your hips back over your heels. Open the throat, looking a little forward so the neck is not compressed. Feel light as you reach, lengthen. Feel light as if you are floating. As you lower the leg, separate the feet, bow, sway, and enjoy the feeling of openness. Return for more Rasayo videos.